<sighs> I guess I have to be the one to tell you. You're dead. This city... We're all fighting over scraps here. I've seen it raised by fire, shaken by quakes. Whatever you do in my city, I will hear about it. Seattle is firmly under my control. You're obviously new to this whole existence, but truth is, most of you types won't even make it a whole year. So you probably figured out that you need to drink blood. You can't just do whatever you want. Cities are carved up by political factions. Never tell anyone about what you are. See, vampires are extremely territorial. Unwittingly poach in someone's territory and suddenly flip. We have one rule. You don't break the masquerade. What the hell? Um, welcome to the first day of the rest of your death. Having fun yet? I'm happy to see you accepted my invitation. All I need you to do is to find a thin blood by the name of Slug. He's in hiding. But the Nosferatu most likely know where he is. Once you find Slug, all you have to do is purchase some information off of him. Feel free to use whatever methods are needed to get him to comply. I assume your handlers have sent you to find our smelly friend. You can find Slug under the freeway, or in a place the locals call the jungle. He's smart enough to hide among the homeless down there, but not quite smart enough to do it well. Talk to him about coming to see us, and no one needs to know. We'll let you keep anything you've been promised from whoever sent you to me. But you'll want to watch yourself. Lots of unsavory animals in the jungle. I don't know you. That's a good start. Slug is a coward, but he survived this long on his own, so he's bound to be a handful. He's also not the only one you'll need to look out for. Just let me go. Come on. Just let me leave. 